information this evening about Sunday's officer-involved shooting that happened out in West Valley City. We now know the name of the man who police shot and killed. He is 20-year-old Elijah Smith. Now, it happened in a cul-de-sac near 3500 South in Janelle's Bay yesterday afternoon. News for Utah's Haley Higgins joins us now live from that area with the newest information. Haley. Yesterday's deadly shooting has traumatized this otherwise quiet neighborhood with some homeowners even considering relocating. Terrified. I was terrified. Neighbors holding their families close after Smith was shot and killed by West Valley police. Investigators say he forced his way into this house with three children home alone Sunday afternoon. They range in age from 9 to 13. I can't imagine what and their poor kids, what they're feeling, what they're going through. Yeah, terrifying. Brittany Thursby's kids play with the children who were inside the home when three officers tried to arrest Smith. A patrol officer who's been on the force for less than two years fired the fatal shot, according to investigators. Before entering this home, police say Smith tried to get into another one. That homeowner didn't want to speak publicly, but told News for Utah the man ran off when confronted by her husband and son. Police say officers were chasing Smith because he was a suspect in a theft investigation at a nearby cell phone store and believe the homes he tried to hide in were chosen at random. I mean, just knowing that someone was killed just right there is terrifying. Unified PD is investigating what led up to this shooting and also if officers were justified.